blast of winter-like weather has made it tough to start some popular summer activities, from camping in Rocky Mountain National Park to heading up Trail Ridge Road. Our Michael Labeda spent the day in Rocky Mountain National Park. And Michael, you probably need a rain jacket, an umbrella, and even a parka. Kelly, it was warm in 55 this morning. It's been raining all afternoon. It was snowing up on Trail Ridge Road. And the other day, it was 85. This is Colorado. What can I say? Bring a coat. The road is open, so that means only one thing. It's time to go play outside. Okay, I'm willing to admit that I may have jumped the gun a little bit. This was just 15 days ago when I said Trail Ridge Road in Rocky Mountain National Park was open for the season. And maybe the mountains of snow and gusting wind should have given me a clue, but it's June. No way winter could return, right? Yeah, it's uh, amazing. It's crazy. Well, here we are on June 22nd, and once again, the road is closed for weather. We want to like uh, explore. explore this area, and uh, we thought this road should be uh, open. open for the entire uh, national park, but actually it's not. Yin Gao and Xiao Kui drove up from Colorado Springs to see the views, but were stopped short, just like hundreds of others. But that didn't stop them from having a good time. We will go to Bear Creek and go back to Astor Park. Down near Bear Creek, the threat of snow sure didn't stop Luke Guidis and his buddies. They drove up from Orlando to Camp Colorado, and now they're realizing they might be a little unprepared. Uh, we definitely could have been more prepared. We weren't expecting it to be nearly this cold, but we brought enough blankets and sleeping bags and our body heat definitely helps. But he admits the cold mountain air does have its benefits. It's pretty comfortable to sleep in at night. Well, all in all, nobody really seemed to mind the threat of colder weather. They just wanted to enjoy their summer vacations, even if it doesn't really feel like it. In Estes Park, Michael Aveta, covering Colorado first. All right. Thanks, Michael.